Most people struggle with money. They live paycheck to paycheck. They have debt. They don't know where their money goes. The 75-10-15 rule offers a solution. It is a simple, effective way to manage your money. This plan helps you take control of your finances. It puts you on the path to financial freedom. The 75-10-15 rule is about balance. It's not about deprivation. You allocate your after-tax income into three main categories, 75% for spending, 10% for saving, and 15% for investing. This system ensures you cover your needs, prepare for emergencies, and build long-term wealth. It's a holistic approach to financial well-being. The beauty of this rule is its simplicity. It's easy to understand and implement. You don't need a finance degree. You don't need complicated spreadsheets. All you need is commitment and discipline. This rule is your roadmap to a secure future. Start today take control of your money. Use the 75-10-15 rule as your guide. You can achieve your financial goals, live with peace of mind. The 75% category covers your essential expenses. This includes housing, food, transportation, utilities, and other necessities. It also includes discretionary spending like entertainment and dining out. The key is to be mindful of your spending habits. Track your expenses for a month. Identify areas where you can cut back without sacrificing your lifestyle. Negotiate better rates for services like internet and insurance. Look for discounts and deals when shopping. Small changes can make a big difference. Prioritize needs over wants. Do you really need that new gadget or designer handbag? Delay gratification. Save up for larger purchases instead of using credit. This will help you avoid debt and build good financial habits. Living within your means doesn't mean living a boring life. It's about making conscious choices. Spend money on things you value. Experiences often bring more joy than material possessions. Remember, it's not about deprivation. It's about being smart with your money. Life is unpredictable. Unexpected expenses can arise at any time. Car repairs, medical bills, job loss. These events can derail your finances. That's why having an emergency fund is crucial. Aim to save 10% of your after-tax income in a separate, easily accessible account. This fund serves as your safety net. It provides peace of mind knowing you can handle emergencies without going into debt. Start with a smaller goal, like $1,000. Once you reach it, gradually increase your savings. Ideally, your emergency fund should cover three to six months of living expenses. This provides a buffer during times of financial uncertainty. Your emergency fund is not for vacations or impulse buys. It's there for true emergencies. Resist the temptation to dip into it for non-essential expenses. This fund is your financial lifeline. Protect it. Investing is not just for the rich. It's for anyone who wants to grow their wealth over time. By investing 15% of your income, you're planting seeds for a secure financial future. There are various investment options available. Two popular choices are Roth IRAs and 401ks. These retirement accounts offer tax advantages, making them ideal for long-term savings. A Roth IRA allows you to contribute after-tax dollars. Your earnings grow tax-free and you don't pay taxes on withdrawals in retirement. This is a great option for young adults who anticipate being in a higher tax bracket later in life. A 401k is an employer-sponsored retirement plan. You contribute pre-tax dollars which lowers your taxable income. Some employers offer matching contributions, essentially free money. Choosing between a Roth IRA and a 401k depends on your individual circumstances. A 401k with an employer match is hard to beat. Contribute enough to get the full match. If your employer doesn't offer a 401k or you've maxed out your contributions, a Roth IRA is a great option. You can open one through a brokerage firm or financial institution. Both Roth IRAs and 401ks offer tax advantages and help you save for retirement. It's essential to start investing early, regardless of which option you choose. The power of compound interest is on your side. Diversify your investments within your retirement accounts. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Consider a mix of stocks, bonds, and mutual funds. This helps mitigate risk and maximize your potential returns. Earning a paycheck is important, but it shouldn't be your only source of income. Building wealth requires owning assets that generate income. This could include rental properties, dividend-paying stocks, or a business. Assets put money in your pocket, while liabilities take money out. Owning your home, for example, can be a significant asset. 
as you pay down your mortgage you build equity. Investing in yourself is also crucial. Acquire new skills, pursue higher education, or start a side hustle. These investments can lead to higher earning potential and greater financial security. Remember, building wealth takes time and discipline. It's a marathon, not a sprint. By following the October 15th 75 rule, investing wisely and owning assets, you can achieve your financial dreams and live a life of abundance.